The December 31st deadline to remove Syria's most dangerous chemical weapons has been missed. The international operation to rid the arsenal was delayed due to various factors, including bad weather, changing battlegrounds and the complex nature of buying equipment. The Syrian government agreed to give up its weapons by this June under the deal after a sarin nerve agent gas attack killed hundreds of people last August. Under the plan, the Syrian government is responsible for safe packaging and transport of the weapons to the port of Latakia, Last month, government forces managed to regain control of the main highway between Damascus and the coast. However, there is still fear of an ambush by rebel fighters. Officials in the city of Latakia are also preparing for the operation, including logistics and security. Norwegian and Danish ships seen here are waiting to remove the weapons. Crews have been training for any eventuality, including rescue operations and decontamination exercises. The cargo ships will transport the chemicals to Italy, where they will be transferred to another ship before being destroyed. Following the delay, the ships were returned to Cyprus several days ago. Experts overseeing the mission say the task of destroying the weapons is still on track. The delay comes as the death toll of the Syrian civil war surpasses 130,000 people, according to the Syrian Observatory for Human Rights.